number 10. Hello, my friends. Thank you so much for joining us today for Fresh Fire Chat. Many of you have been along this journey for a while. For those of you who are new, welcome again. And we're going back to the bestseller, the award-winning, fantastic book that, book that many of you have, Fresh Passion, Get a Brand or Die Generic. And the piece that I want to bring your attention to today is about keeping a daily routine. It's about being more productive. Productivity, a daily routine to maximize the day. You don't have the ability to add more hours to the day, so you have to maximize that time. That's the difference between people who are ultra uh, 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 competitive, ultra successful, versus those folks who are just getting the mediocre piece. It's because they're not maximizing the moment. So in our last piece, in our last chat, I introduce you to the idea of keeping your brand fresh and relevant and provided an overview of how to do that Today I want to go a little bit deeper and give you a simple tool that you can use to implement what I call this productivity and how do you become more productive? productive. How do you maximize the moment? You know, I believe that everyone can take these five fresh steps and really begin to put a daily routine in place that will really impact the freshness of your brand. If you think about it, start from a model in your industry, whether you love him or hate him. Uh, when we think real estate, we, we, we think Donald Trump. And I'll just give you a few things that he does. Um, he rises at 6 a.m. I know that might be early or late for some of you. Spends an hour in the morning reading the newspapers to understand what's going on in the world so that he can react to it. Arrives at work by nine. Again, that might be early or late from you. I'm talking about someone in the industry who's been quite successful. And he makes 50 to 100 phone calls a day. Now that's important when you say, I need to really put the time in. I really need to be focused. I really need to be productive. So I make, he's making these calls to say, what is my return? The more calls I make, the greater the return and the greater probability that I might close a deal. Making one to two calls is oftentimes not enough. And you look up at the middle of the day and say, I really haven't made, I'm, I'm not productive. I've not made this happen. So think about that when you look at how many things you need to do multiple times to really become more productive. He has at least a dozen meetings, each of which lasts no more than 15 minutes. And I know a lot of you, myself have included, have been in this death spiral of meetings that you're meeting to meet about meeting, about meeting, about meeting. And then at the end of the meeting, you're scheduling another meeting. You need to guard and protect your time if you want to be productive. Don't get into this vicious cycle of just having meetings with no point, no focus, no agenda. You need to take control and say, what is this meeting about? What's expected? And put a time limit. If, the, if it can't be done in 15, 20, 30 minutes, then ask yourself, why am I here? Can we find a more creative way to get this done? So maybe your five first steps is, hey, I'm going to get up at 7 o'clock. I'll have a Starbucks. That would be my routine. I read, read something that's industry related so that I'm fresh and relevant and I know what's going on in my industry. I contact a minimum of 15 clients. Your number might be different, but at least you put a target there. Uh, you take a client to business or to, to, to a business meeting or to a lunch because again, you have that one hour in the day. Do you really need that time to refocus or can you maximize that hour that you can have something else going on beside lunch? And then you think about, okay, I want to do, I want to have a goal of, of seeing X number of clients by the end of the day. So we talked about kind of these five things and whatever that five is for you, just get it on paper and begin to say, this is what I'm going to start the day with. This is what productivity means for me. I'm maximizing that moment. So what would your fresh five looks like? Take a moment when, when we finish chat and don't do it now because I want you to focus on me and think about the five things that you can do that are routine for you that will increase your productivity. Again, thank you so much for spending this time with us. And if you're ever wondering how to be ultra successful, just ignite the fresh fire that you have inside and watch that success explode. Until next time, have a fantastic day.